Hi, this is Josh Carnes, founder of Revelation Guitar Amplifiers, and I want to show you our new uh, Tone Factory. Uh, this is sort of like a guitar amp utility tool. Uh, it fixes many of the common problems that you might have with a traditional tube amplifier. And uh, in this particular demonstration, I'd like to show you how it works as an attenuator. Uh, in this case, um, we're going to use a Revelation Roxy amplifier, which is an 18 watt amp. Uh, it's extremely loud, uh, and uh, we're going to show you how I can play that amp uh, along with uh, this acoustic guitar, which is much quieter, uh, and they blend together just fine in this room. What's going to play is guitar through the uh, Revelation Roxy. It's screaming loud, and then uh, I'm going to attempt to play along with it with my acoustic guitar. And we're going to record the whole thing with just this one microphone. Okay, so obviously uh, the electric guitar is way too loud to play with the acoustic guitar. Now the Tone Factory, unlike a traditional attenuator, uh, it has a reactive speaker load in it, so the amplifier drives the Tone Factory directly, and then it has its own power amplifier built in. Uh, this allows it to create the same tone at any volume level, all the way from 0 to 70 watts of power. Uh, so this is an 18 watt amp, and it's uh, extremely loud here in the room. Uh, we're going to attenuate it down to probably less than one watt in order to get it to play along with uh, this guitar. Uh, so now we're going to do the same example, one microphone, uh, both guitars, but we're going to use the Tone Factory and uh, hopefully we'll be blended together much better this time. We connected the Tone Factory into the amp. Uh, the speaker out from the amplifier is going directly into the front amp jack on the Tone Factory and then the speaker output from the Tone Factory back into the amp selling speaker. Uh, here we've uh, adjusted the sensitivity to where it's about the right level for an 18 watt amp. Uh, and the power level knob here adjusts how loud the thing is going to be. Uh, this would go from 0 to about 70 watts. We'll record the same thing we just did, but with the same microphone. Uh, the only difference is uh, we've added some gain so that we can hear it on the recording.